welcome to my channel welcome back to a brand new video i hope you're all doing well and having a lovely day if you're new here my name is amanda and today guys i have a poundland haul for you a poundland christmas haul so i particularly went in there to pick up items for christmas of course and i've seen that they had this one particular item online and i was happy to find it in my local store so if you'd like to see what i picked up in poundland for christmas please keep watching so the first items that I picked up was this set of twine. So you get a set of three Christmas twines in this packet and these were a pound. So you got, this, I'm going to open it and show you because you probably can't see through the plastic. So you've got this neutral colour one, jute, and then you've also got this red and white one. Okay, and then you've also got another one of the jute ones. Now I'm not sure if I even got some of this from last year in my stash, but um. I haven't actually had a chance to get the Christmas decorations down from the loft as yet. These are still a pound and I remember them being a pound last year. Okay, so that's really good going. I don't know how much meters you get on each roll, but it should be enough to like, you know, do a little DIY with. So next up in the Christmas decorations, I saw these stars. I picked up two. So on the front, you've got this star detail in silver and then the back of it is actually plain. So I'm going to use it on the reverse side, which is just a plain white ceramic star. So like I said, I picked up two of them and these were one pound each. OK, so they had lots of new Christmas decorations coming in. I'm not really going to go all out there with buying like brand new Christmas decorations this year because I've seen the huge box and the bags of Christmas decorations that we have up in the loft. Um, I don't think I'm going to need any more, you know, but if you do see any on the channel, just discard what I've said because the shops have got some amazing Christmas decorations in. Sometimes the temptation is like, you know, the temptation is just too hard. But having saying that, I can appreciate these being a pound. You know, that's why I picked up two of them and they are ceramic as well. OK, so that's those. So next up, I picked up this Christmas wire, 37 metres, and that was also a pound. And it's in that lovely forest green colour. So I've got this to do some DIYs with, okay, for Christmas, for sure. I also picked up this. Now, this is your cutlery holder. It's a pack of four, and it's in the shape of a Christmas tree. So I'm going to open this up as well and show you, because I thought these would be absolutely perfect to put on, like, the children's table, because more than likely, we're going to be hosting Christmas dinner this year. OK, so there's going to be a few little children coming over as well. This is a pack of four. I may have to go back and get another set if it's like the vibe that I'm kind of looking for. These are felt Christmas tree cutlery holders. So they've kind of demonstrated with a cardboard cutlery there. So you've got the felt Christmas tree and then you just pop your cutlery in the slots. Like so or something like that. So yes, I've got those and those were a pound as well. Okay, so next up, I picked up some socks for myself. I absolutely love the socks in the Pep & Co section of Poundland. They are, I don't know if they're 100% cotton, but I just absolutely love the texture of the socks and they're so comfortable and cosy. So you get five pairs of socks and these were three pounds so these have gone up by 50p guys they used to be two pounds 50 because i get these all the time i don't have these designs okay so this is in a lovely navy blue color with the white stars and then you've got this pair here which is a gray and you've got the blue stars on there okay so next up i picked up this fleece blanket now this is in the pet section of poundland um the blanket itself is 80 centimeters by 100 centimeters and i thought we don't have any pets, but I thought this would be perfect to do like a little pet hamper. I've got a few friends that have recently um, adopted or got new pets this year. You know, one's got a dog, one's got a rabbit and another one's got a cat. So I thought this would be like perfect to make up like a little um, hamper for a pet. So that's why I've got this and this was £1.50. But I do wish it was the green tartan, you know, for Christmas. You don't really have to use this for a pet. You can just have like a blanket in your car. You know when you go into like the Christmas markets or you're going Christmas shopping and you're coming back and you feel like a little bit, okay, you can put the heater on in the car, yes you can, but it's always nice to have a little blanket, isn't it? So yeah, it's like a, you know, it's not a huge size, but you know, perfect to just put over your legs while you're in the car, driving or as a passenger in the car, you know. So yes, yeah, so I've got that as well. So next up, I've got some 
marshmallows, Christmas marshmallows, and I also picked up this. So this is your matchmakers in the zingy orange flavour. And I absolutely love these. I love them so much to the fact that I've actually eaten them all. Yes, I, I had the whole packet, guys. Coming up the road, walking up the road with my shopping, I was just munching on them. These are so delicious. But in Poundland, they're doing some offers on their sweets and on their snacks. So these came to £1.25 for the both of them, okay, on the offer. I think that's right. Then I also picked up one of these cocktail bowls. Now these went out of stock in my local stores. So I'm so glad that I saw it in store today. It can be used for multiple uses. Okay, so I've got this like to put the Christmas sweets in. I just have them on the table so the kiddies can just help themselves. You know, rather than have something ceramic for the kids because there's gonna be quite a few kids around on Christmas day and I don't want any, any accidents. So this is plastic bit of fun as well they can just put their hands in and you know choose the sweets that they like so i've got that and this was actually one pound fifty okay it used to be a pound it's gone up by 50p as well so this next item i was so happy that they've actually brought these back this year um it's a cake tin or a biscuit tin or a a tin for any kind of um you can use it for storage as well now these went out of stock as well in my local stores and I wasn't able to get them. I actually wanted to use this one for a, a DIY project coming up on the channel for Christmas. So I was so happy that they've got these in. Now this one was a little bit, a little bit damaged, like a little bit dented. I got it for one pound, they're normally two pounds. So I didn't mind that because I'm just gonna use it for a quick DIY project. And yeah, you won't, you won't actually see that anyway. So yeah. These are two pounds in Poundland. I've got it for a pound. It's got a little dent on the side, but they're absolutely brilliant for storing your cakes. If you're making cakes, cupcakes, you know, a nice square Christmas cake or to store your crafts in or to store bits and bobs in. Okay, so I've got that as well. So I did say that this was a Poundland Christmas haul, but I do have a few other bits that I picked up as well, which I'm just gonna show you. The next item, this is what I actually went into Poundland to get. And I was so happy again that my local store had it in because I've been looking for a Christmas wreath. Um, I'm thinking about DIYing my own one, but I saw this online and I have got a few DIYs planned for Christmas, but if I can sort of get away with not doing one, I'm happy with that, you know? So here it is guys, Poundland are doing the most beautiful wreath this year. Now it's not a huge wreath, it is 40 centimeters and I just absolutely love the detail on there. So I'm just gonna take it out guys and show you. And here it is. It's absolutely beautiful, isn't it, guys? It's so gorgeous. Okay, and it's got these um, pine cones on there. It's a nice, soft texture flock. And it's also got some faux berries on there. And it's got these wooden stars on there as well. It does need to be sort of like fluffed out a bit. But, you know, for £8, I thought this was absolutely amazing. That's what I got. That's what I actually went to Poundland to get and I'm so glad that I got it. That's all the Christmas bits. Now I'm just going to show you some general um, items that I got from Poundland as well. I picked up these set of craft needles and these were a pound as well. You get three needles or four needles in here. Okay, and they're nice large ones. So that's going to come in handy for some DIYs. So I also picked up some face wipes. These are still 50p guys in Poundland and they're really good face wipes. Now I used to use Simple, I used to use another face wipes that I used to get in Tesco. But now that I've discovered these, these are my go-to. This one is the Sensitive Complete Cleansing Wipes. And then I've also picked up this one which is a Deep Cleanse Complete Wipe. And that was also, oh, sorry I've gone out of focus. So I also picked up this packet which is your Deep Cleanse Complete Cleansing Wipes. Again, you get 25 in a pack and those were also 50p. They're really good wipes, guys. For 50p, you can't go wrong, okay? Also picked up two packets of Germaline. Okay, so Germaline is your antiseptic cream. Now, these are the smaller tubes. I think it's um 30 mil, yeah, or 30 grams. So Germaline has been around for years. This was like the one thing that you'll use when you get a little graze on your leg as a child. So I always have this in our medicine cupboard. These are a pound for the 30 grams in Poundland and I thought that was really good because a lot of the stores sell this a lot more than a pound. So I picked up two tubes of it. The expiry date on it is 2025. So 
you know, stock up. I'm stocking up. Yep, so I've got those. So the next item I picked up was another pair of these socks for Little Oakley. Those are just going to go into his Christmas box. He's absolutely obsessed with Star Wars at the minute. You've got your Baby Yoda and then you've got Mandorium there as well. Okay, so two pairs of socks for a £1.50. So the next item I'm going to show you is from Pep & Co Fashion. And guys, I went into Pep & Co. I picked up a few things, but um, some of them I've actually worn already. Yeah. And this item, I haven't actually worn it out yet, but I have to share it with you because it's just absolutely gorgeous. I haven't actually jumped on the bandwagon with the whole jacket thing. I was meant to get one last year, but when I went into store, I saw one in Primark actually last year. And Zara had an amazing one. But when I went in to get it, out of stock so this year when I went into Pep and Co I couldn't believe it guys they had a very similar to, similar one to what I've seen online in Zara and it's absolutely gorgeous so this is it guys a shacket a shacket so I'm gonna try it on so you get a better idea of what I'm going on about it's so so nice oh my goodness it's so so gorgeous I absolutely love it now this was £18, I think, or £20 in um, Pep & Co. So, I don't know if you guys can see how I'm wearing it here. Yeah, so guys, I absolutely love it. So, as you can see, nice large pockets at the top, and you've got these side pockets here as well. And what I also love about it is that it's got these um, the scallop. The edges are scalloped. They're not just square cut. It's got a nice rounded edge, and I just absolutely love this jacket. Now, I'm probably not doing it much justice showing it to you like this. And they had so many different designs. Well, not designs. What, what I should say. They had different cuts of the fabric of this. So I was really searching for one with the dark colours and not with the light colours. So if I wear any makeup, it doesn't actually get onto the collars, you know. But this was £18. Okay, 18 or £20 from Pep & Co. And I just absolutely love it. It's so warm, it's so cosy, the fabric is nice and soft. It's absolutely gorgeous. And I love these tortoiseshell buttons on there as well. So that's my last item, guys. I really hope you enjoyed the video. Do give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you are new. I love to have you on board and love to have you as part of my YouTube family. And I'd like to say thank you for those of you that have recently jumped onto the channel, that have recently subscribed. I appreciate every single one of you. I appreciate your time of sitting down and watching my videos. Um, do let me know in the comments which was your favourite item from today's video. Mine has to be, you know, the item that I really went into Poundland to get, which is my Christmas wreath. Okay, I'm not sure if I'm actually going to put this onto my front door. It might it might go in the hallway. You know, so I'm looking to, like, revamp our hallway. And I might do, I still might do a DIY wreath for the front door. Okay, because this is quite small, but it's still a lovely wreath, you know. And for £8, you really can't go wrong. So yeah, that has to be my favourite from today's haul. But do let me know in the comments which was your favourite. So again, thank you so much for watching. Take care, keep well, and I shall see you soon on the next video.